Today's celebration of Dr. Martin Luther King's birthday provides teachers with opportunities to teach students about a very important time in our nation's history. In tonight's Education Matters, Juanita Stevenson reports on some of the creative ways teachers get students to understand the principles Dr. King stood for. Every year, they gather at Courthouse Park in downtown Fresno to honor slain civil rights leader Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. Whether they are elected officials, members of the community, or school children, they all come to celebrate the principles that King stood for. I think it's a great thing to honor him. It's good that we never forget him for like standing up for people. For school children, the civil rights movement that took place in the late 50s and through the 60s is stuff they read about in the history books. But their teachers tell us recent events like the protest over criminal justice and at Standing Rock have many students asking questions. We're still fighting a fight for equality on many different levels. And so seeing Dr. Martin Luther King as a historical figure and his impact shows them that one person can stand up and really make a difference. So for their History Day project, Victoria Guerrero's World History class at Central East High School in Fresno chose to research and report on Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. In our project, we have a lot of examples of how he spoke out to get like to for what he believes in and I think this explains perfectly that you shouldn't just stand there you should speak for what you want exactly like how Martin Luther King did. Teachers say learning history this way helps students understand how it relates to them. It's not something old to be studied in books but a story to be told. The kids in making a presentation of sorts they can say well this is what happened in the past this is how it impacts us today this is why we still worry about it this is why we still talk about it. So I think in that way, um, students got a different view, the true view of what history really is. A lot of other people couldn't see or appreciate the diversity within the world. Getting students to understand this part of our nation's history was also the focus in Alexis Freeman's fourth and fifth grade class at Teague Elementary. I think it's important for them to understand that the world that they live in and the society that exists now is not the same society that existed for everyone previously. So Freeman took a different approach when it came to getting these nine and ten year olds to understand the importance of Dr. King and why he is honored today. She had her students draw pictures of themselves and then she wrote down words like respect happiness, day, success. I took away that everybody's different and we should all respect everybody. She wanted them to see that although they may look different, they all want the same things. Respect, to be happy, successful. Basic rights that Dr. King believed in. That he made a tour that I could have friends all over. They made a video sharing their hopes and dreams and how they were influenced by Dr. King. They hope to inspire others. What's your dream? Our class dreams big. Ms. Freeman's class plans to share their video with other classrooms at Teague Elementary. They hope to get other students to think about the ways Dr. King inspired them. For Education Matters, I'm Renita Stevenson, KC24, local news that matters.